Hey guys, King of Worms here, and we are back! We are back in our adventures of Drunkamon, and last time we left off, Elm, something's wrong with the lab. So let's go save our daddy boy. What? He's not our dad. But let's go save our good Professor Elm by walking in the grass and fighting something. So let's see, bug boys. A wheel? I think we'll fuck this wheel up, guys. I think we'll fuck him up. I think we'll just absolutely wreck him. Do you guys think so? Leave a leave a comment in this, leave a comment in the comic section, or comment down below. I'm retarded as hell right now. Down below, if you think we'll kill this wheel. Okay, your votes have been answered. Your votes have been tallied. And eighty per eighty percent of you who said you will kill, we will kill this wheel. You were correct. Right? I'm not going to be wrong. You were correct. You guys get a good old drink of some kind. I don't know what kind. If you were drinking water right now, you get a nice big old two liter pitcher, glass pitcher of water. That actually sounds good. Like I, I love those like pitchers of water. Holy shit. Holy shit. Talk normally, you fat piece of shit. Okay, so I love those two liter, like, water port, like, containers that they have at, right, like, restaurants there. And they just pour it for you. And then you just leave it at the table. I'm like, yes. I don't have to ask you six billion times for more water. And there's always something refreshing about a nice cold glass of water. I think it's a psychology thing. I think there's a thing or a name for that thing where, like, Drinking water just pleases you to a point where it's just weird, but you just, you can't say no, but you're like, damn right, I love this so much. This tickles me in the right places at the right time. But I don't know. But yeah, so. Could be worse. But, oh! Whoa, who is this red individual? Red-headed individual. I don't I don't think I like him very much. I don't think I like him. I already know he's our rival. Shut up. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I gotta play it off like the first time I've ever played this game. You know, the concept of this guy stealing the starter Pokemon blew my mind as a kid. Like, yeah, Elm didn't give it to you? What do you mean? That's wrong! Stealing is wrong. And then I stole for the first time after that, thinking, hey, this guy looks cool. Maybe stealing's cool. But in reality, it's not, kids. It's not. Oh, you're doing okay for somebody weak. I'm kicking your ass. Why are you calling me weak? Well, thank you. Thank you for lowering my defense while I kick your ass. Because you're weak. Because you're pathetic. Because you're stupid ugly. I don't know how you're stupid ugly, but who knows, man. Level 9, level 9. Go to level 9, boys and girls. Are you happy now? Yeah, I'm happy. I got $500. Do you want to know who I am? I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. No, you're not. I am. That's where I come in place. I'm going to... I'm going to be the one who becomes the Pokemon champion in two regions and beat Red. Yeah. I'm going to do it, guys. This is actually going to be very long. I just realized that. Ooh. I can't wait. This is going to be a very long playthrough. I just got to record one episode a day or two or maybe a whole like five episodes a day and all will be fine. So who, what's, 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 what's running up the lab here, boy, but boy, who are you? We are investigating a case, a missing person, Pokemon here, I almost said person. Yeah, Pokemon are people, right? Except for we treat them, we keep them in balls and they do whatever the fuck we want them to do. They're not people, they're slaves. It's kind of wrong, I'm saying slaves aren't people. Slaves are people, but they're like, Pokemon are people, kind of. Do you think Pokemon are people? Like, because all they say is their fucking name. They don't say anything. Oh, okay, this is where we get the name, our rival. 
And when I was playing this, I might have been already a little buzzed because like I was critting the, because I had the rule whenever they crit you, you drink, and I felt like it was way too much. Now looking back, so I called them sober, because we're drunk, we're drunk, and he's sober. So who's the? So I thought it would be perfect because they were real life rival to sober is drunk. So it makes sense, guys. I thought it was fucking hilarious. I know you guys are just rolling your eyes, cringe worthy, but yeah, I thought it was goddamn funny. It still is. I'm still laughing my ass off about it. <laughs> Drunk. I'm gl glad they understand that you are innocent. Yeah, and Elm would have backed me up, saying, "No, this guy was at Mr. Pokemon when the thing happened." Okay, bye. Drunk. Drunk. This is terrible. Oh, yes. What is Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? How did the mystery egg? What? An egg? This is impossible. As a Pokemon professor, how are you surprised that Pokemon lay eggs? This still baffles me to this day why it, this is like such a big thing. Like, even if you... Like, that could have been a single head of Executor. Or however you say its name, I don't know. It's for Gen 1, but I still never saw it enough to fucking care about it. Like, Executor. Like, how is that any different? Like, I could have just handed you one piece of the head. Or the body. And you would have been like, holy shit, this is a discovery. And also, last time, I had this amazing concrete theory about Executor. So I said Executor was the original... Eve, like you know, like Adam and Eve, like the Jesus, like the Bible thing. So, Adam and Eve, so Executor was both Adam and Eve because it just had to hatch itself. So, Adam hatched an egg, or Eve hatched an egg, it became, and then it produced another Pokemon. After that, it did some other weird shit. Um, I'm, I'm getting distracted here by healing my Pokemon. So, the other part to that was it hatched an egg. <laughs> And then all of a sudden, it's a different Pokemon. And then another egg hatch, and it's a different Pokemon. And then, like, all until all the eggs of an Executor were hatched, like six. And it was, like, each of one type. The original types. There were more types than that, but we'll, I'm going on to it now. So it hatched, and then those Pokemon bred with each other, producing offsprings. And then later, and they kept producing offsprings, kept producing offsprings, until we got, like, the Pokemon that we have now. Like really fucked up, like fucking snowman or ice cream cone Pokemon. So it was like, and then Executor was still in the DNA. So when one Pokemon bred <laughs> with another one, and Pokemon egg came out, and when from the egg a, a batch of eggs came out somehow. <laughs> oh no! I don't want you to save my money. No. You're gonna spend my money on weird shit. But I don't know. I think it's a concrete fit. Theory that can't be proven elsewise. And don't look in too deep into it. Or don't look too deep into it. Because otherwise, it, the theory just goes out the window. But just take it as a, take it as I said. Even though looking, when I'm going to watch this later. Because I do watch my stuff, guys. Like when I'm editing. It, it'll sound retarded as hell. But I still think it's a good idea. Like good theory of like how... Pokemon came to be like Arceus created Executor. Executor hatched its eggs. Fucking other other Pokemon like this Rata fucked another Pidgey, and all of a sudden Meryl came out. Okay, I'm not even questioning this. This is a fantastic theory. Like, come on, guys, you, you can't you can't ignore the facts here. Like, that's an amazing fact. And then Pokemon kept fucking with other Pokemon and other Pokemon, and then. We have the Pokemon today, and now there's only sp interbreeding before there was... Like, Pokemon will only fuck the same Pokemon. Or have sex with the same race as them, because Pokemon are racist. And they believe it's wrong if two Pokemon breed together. Cause, and now it's like, tabooed and shit. I don't know. I thought, wait, no. Yes. I'm going with it. I don't know. I confused myself there for a little bit. 
Just like that, lower your Pokemon health. Eh, whatever, whatever. Shut up, shut up, shut up. I got Pokeballs. So now the Nuzlocke, in terms of catching stuff, begins. So boys and girls, what's the first Pokemon we're going to get? Mm -hmm. Oh, I actually didn't get this last time. I got a Pidgey. I've actually never caught one of these things and used it. I'm actually super scared that my thing will kill it because it... Ooh! Oh, I actually tickled me the wrong way. Centric. Use the Pokeball because it's... I, if I hit it again, I'm it's gonna die. What's <laughs> the problem with having shit? What? You are not using every single Pokeball that I have here, buddy. You're getting in the Pokeball right now, mister. Get in that ball! Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Get in the ball! That's what I'm talking about! Woo! And actually putting up my arms there hurt because I, I just got back from the gym. Or before, after I filmed. So before I recorded this, I was at the gym for like an hour. I got a nickname it though. Uh, and it was arm day, so now lifting my arms. I, it's like I'm an infant. I can I can barely lift my arms. So Centrix. Centrix. Cent. Scent right? Scent right. Scent right. Ah, fuck it was the first thing that came to my mind. <laughs> I'm very bad at naming Pokemon guys. So if you have a funny name that you think one of my Pokemon should get, uh, it doesn't matter which one. Like, I would prefer the next Pokemon I catch, not the one I already have. Unless the name is so fantastically good, I can't, I can't resist it. So, if you have a name for a Pokemon, any Pokemon, shoot, shoot it in the comment. Send it to the, oh my god, sh shoot me in the face right now. Put it in the comment section below and I'll, and I'll probably name it one of those things. Because, why not, I'm bad at naming. Holy shit, this thing looks so cute behind me. It kind of looks like a rat or a squirrel. Eh, rat dog. We're going to call it a rat squirrel dog. So now we're going to do... So I also need to ask you guys something. Do you want grinding in the episode or do you want it out of the episode? In this episode, we're going to do it regardless because it's level 5 or 3. So, oh, this one's level 2. We actually hit the barrel, guys. So, yeah. We we got lucky. We got very lucky. We could have had a Pidgey, which could have saved our ass later. Because I actually like Pidgey. Except for I like I like Knock or uh, Hoot Hoot later. And I totally would have named it Hooters, by the way. That's my go-to name for every... Hoot Hoot? I would have named it Hooters. <laughs> Cause I find that <laughs> I don't know why, but I always think of like when I think of Hoot Hoot, I think of like some and I give it the name Hooters. I just think of it working at Hooters for the big ass and the big tits. I would think I find it would be hilarious as hell. I've actually never been at a Hooters. This thing's gonna kill the shit out of me. There we go. And I'm healed. I w I've never been in a Hooters. I'm sorry, I uh, trailed off there. I've never been in a Hooters. But damn, would it be funny. To be like... Like, not funny to be in a Hooters, but like the fucking... Not, like, Hoot Hoot. Big ass titties. <laughs> I just love that idea so much. So, if I see a Hooter, or a uh, Hoot Hoot, it's, it's totally called Hooters. And like the picture at the bottom there, it's going to literally have huge tits. I'm going to make that a thing. I'm going to do it. I want a Hoot Hoot now. Defense curled. I learned defense curls, guys. It's moving up in the world. It's aging. 
boy is aging. Oh, come on. All right, the last piece of grass again. Let's go, boys. Let's go. What is it? A Pidgey. A level two Pidgey. We're going to fucking shit up, guys. We're going to fucking... We're going to bring back interspecies relationships. Fuck this interbreeding. Or this, uh... No interbreed. I don't know what the fucking word is. Racist ass shit. How about that? We're going to stop this racist ass Pokemon shit. And we're going to make sure... How is it faster than me? If that crit, I probably would have been This guy would have been dead. And sent right <laughs> would be gone forever. Can I get a shit? I can't get around that. So I'm gonna I'm not gonna waste a potion here. I'm gonna switch the two. Oh wait, oh shit. Actually we have one more spot where we can get Pokemon in. It's this area! Up here. So let's see what's the next Pokemon here. You can get a Spearow up here. I like Spearow. He's kind of cool. Or a Fero. Spearow. Spearow! A level 2 Spearow. God damn it. This is going to kill it. 100%. It's going to kill it. Cyndaquil, I'm actually mad that you didn't kill it. Come on. Pretend like it's your... Pretend like that guy slept with your wife. Come on. Like, I, I'm glad. I'm glad and mad at the same time. Like, you know what I'm feeling, guys? I'm almost... I'm like four levels, or four times its level, and it didn't one-shot it. And I know it's tackle, but still. That thing should have killed the fucking shit out of that Spiro. Just saying. That's, that's, that's my political views on that. What about your guys'? Should Spiro have killed him? 100% yes. Ah, uh, so name for Spiro. Ro. Ro. Bo Ro. Bo. Ro. Bo Ro. Bo Ro. Bo Ro. Guys, I, 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 I thought it was cool. I still think it's cool to this day. So that. So let's see what what roots were those. So I gotta, I gotta keep this written down somewhere because otherwise I'll forget. So that's Route 46, and Route 29 down. We cannot catch Pokemon in Route 20 46 or 29. So let's. So those two road, those two lanes or routes routes, different words for the same shit. Because English is weird. That's a Pidgey. A level 2 Pidgey. Kind of wish I got that instead of the fucking Scent Right. You know what? I love Scent Right. Scent Right is my baby girl or boy. Is that... Was it a boy or girl? I think it was a boy. I was confused the fucking shit out of the... Uh... Out of like those symbols like the for female and male. Wait, is there something down here? Nope. Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, I have your brother here. I have your brother. And what are you gonna do about it? You gonna fight me? You gonna fight for your brother? Well, trust me. I'm giving him a good home. I'm giving him a really good home. So don't worry about it. Because at the end of the day, you're dead. What? Oh, I didn't drink the last two times. Shit. Yeah, because I caught I caught two Pokemon, so that's why I drink. By the way, completely forgot about the rules there for a second. So, would you like to rest your Pokemon? Yes, I would like to rest my Pokemon, my Nurse Joy. Thank you so much for being here, you beautiful lady. You. Is it just me? In the Pokemon anime. Why was Brock all over every Nurse Joy? It made no sense. Man has no loyalty. But on that note, guys, that is the end of this episode. See you guys later. Have a good one, and see you around.